Is this a 15 meter die handmade <laughs> CPU? This is this really, is, yes. I, do we need to slap a bird on this? <laughs> Probably. Uh, so this is a project built by uh, just a computer science geek uh, called the Mega Processor. It is a working CPU blown up in size to allow you to walk in to the processor and watch how data is physically processed by your own eyes. Uh, so there's a bunch of LEDs that show what is happening um, at each portion of the processor. If you click on the picture, you get a slightly bigger version of it. And you can see that each kind of section has its own uh, label, right? So uh, you can see the second from the right is the ALU. That's the arithmetic logic unit. So that's like oh where goodness. the actual math takes place. You have general purpose registers on the right-hand side, and to the left of it, you have special purpose registers. Um, you have your input and output, like instruction decode to the left of it. And then if you go all the way to the left, the one that just looks like a mash of green is the memory. That is, that's the CPU's cache, if you will, the memory system that it uses to store data, how you load programs into it. Um, and so you can actually watch a program that is built for this uh, run through. And it was built with like wire and ribbon cables and right. all by hand. Um, well, I, the, it, the, the, the backstory on this is crazy because uh, the, the guy that built this, right, 42,000 transistors, weighs half a ton, kind of fits in a truck. Uh, James Newman says there was a conversation at work about that about that time when we were talking about debugging something and someone remarked it would be easier if we had an LED on a signal. Um, and he wanted to learn about transistors and, quote, things got out of hand. <laughs> 42,000 tra hand soldered transistors later. Um, his ultimate goal, other than the pure satisfaction of building the thing and getting it running, uh, as the register reported in June, was to show the public how computers work by blowing the CPU up to a human viewable scale. Crazy. Excuse me, 42,300 transistors, 10,548 LEDs all hand soldered into place. And the LEDs visually trace the path of data through the giant processor. This is so cool. <laughs> it's really, really cool. It's apparently now um, at the Center for Computing History in Cambridge. Uh, and I would love to go and see it, right? And this is the kind of thing that if you're a computer science or an electrical engineering major, like watching how this occurs is like super educational. It's not just neat. Like this is this is how they would teach you how to do these types of things. Mm -hmm. um, it's pretty impressive. Runs at 25 kilohertz. <laughs> 25 kilohertz. So there you go. I just think this is, I mean, charming and delightful. I do too. I, I, I think it's great.